What's good, everybody? It's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject here, bringing back College Hoops 2K8. A lot of you guys have asked for me to bring back this series, man, and I did. I really, really do love playing it, but it's hard to play this when you're playing a regular 2K, man. But I, th I think I'm gonna have it here for a long time to stay, man. But you know, what I mean, we just finished our second season with uh, Bethune Cookman, you know, what I mean, and we're being offered better jobs and better programs. Now we're trying to figure out where to go, what's gonna be the best opportunity for us. Now the teams I'm thinking about is Harvard, Gonzaga, Penn, and Drexel. So out of those three schools, man, I'm just trying to weigh the options, who has the best lineup and everything like that. But I'm pretty sure, you know what I mean, I feel like if I go to the Ivy League, you know what I mean, I can win the conference title with no problem. But if I go to Gonzaga, that's going to be the most, you know what I mean, tournament-ready squad that we could possibly have, man. So I'm going to take it over for a few seconds, and I'm going to make my decision. Alright man, so we elected to go with Gonzaga who went 18 and 14 last year. And I mean not the greatest, but it is definitely not the worst. So we're gonna go ahead, go through this priest, go through this priest. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead, go through this offseason, man, try to try to see what recruits we're looking at, and then we're gonna make our way into next year, man. Alright man, so we took a look and uh both both scholarships that Gonzaga had this offseason, you know what I mean, they have they have both used. They signed a uh, two small four, six five and six six, from both from Seattle, Washington. So, uh, yeah, man, that's pretty much gonna be the extent of our recruiting. All right, man, we are officially into our brand new season, season three here, the Coach Legacy mode, man. Uh, let's take a look at the roster. All right, man, so the roster itself, um, we're looking pretty good, man. You know, uh, wish our point guard was a little, little more highly ranked. You know what I'm saying, but. He's gonna hold it down. He's only a sophomore. Got time to improve. And we got so that's class Sim assessments. We got Josh Perkins at the two. Uh, we got Zach Norvell, uh, Alexis uh, Thompson. And we still got Zach Collins, who's a junior, the seven foot monster, man. And we still got some uh, pretty good players off the bench, man. So it's lo it's looking good. As long as we recruit, we should be able to hold things down. All right, man, speaking of recruiting, man, it's time to see who is interested in the squad, who wants to come, who wants to go, you know what I'm saying? And we need to try to pull them in, man. All right, man, so we cleaned up the old uh, pro the old uh, uh, recruitment list and the targets we want to go after, man. We want to make sure we use our points productively and we actually have a chance to get some of these players. All right, man, so these are our top priorities right here. We only have two scholarships. So we got to see who, who is more interested first, who bites first over the next few weeks. So we're going to use every point available, man. So, you know, of course we do want to want to get the four and five stars, but we got to work our way up. The, the computer was only able to bring in two, three stars, man. So, you know what I mean? That's what Gazaga does, does in real life, man. They got to be able to, and they still win. So, you know what I mean? Got to be able to get ready to keep players for the long call, the three, four years. All right, man, so now I'm here checking in on my bench, on my rotation, seeing how deep we're going to go. Um, it seems like off rip, they had their eight men deep, but those seem like all big men and small forwards, so I think I'm going to go ahead and add some minutes to Alberts here. Let's see what he does well. He can shoot it a little bit, nothing too crazy. What is he, a senior? I think it wouldn't have hurt to have a, a whole 10, but we're going to wait and see how it goes, man. Maybe it's the reason why he's down there not looking to get that much playing time, man. So we're going to rock out with the 9 deep. All right, man, so we're here taking a look over our schedule to start off the year. I kept everything the same as I do with most teams the first year I use them. So our first few games are going to be against uh, Cal State, Northridge, North Texas, St. Louis, TCU, and Jacksonville. But like I was saying earlier in the episode, man, this is back. I'm bringing this back. I'm ready to bring college hoops back for you guys. I have fun playing it. You guys usually have fun watching it, man. So gameplay is on the way. 
So uh, without further ado, man, that's going to pretty much do it for this episode. So stop and smash that like button if you're inside it, man. Hit me up in the comment section below. Subscribe if you're new. It's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject, RKGames.com. I'm out this bitch. Peace.